25 years ago when Moscow Ballet first, um, my, our collaboration first um, began, I never dreamed that 25 years later I would be here talking with you and we would actually be celebrating it. Never dreamed it in a million years. It's thrilling. It's been uh, a journey in many ways. Uh, we've both learned, I think, both Dan Center North and Moscow LA along the way. Um, but what an adventure. The, the students have all had a wonderful experience. They are dancing on the stage with professional dancers from all over the world. I have been with Moscow Ballet five years already, but I started to work as audition director at the Chess like since last year, so it will be the second year. I have been learning dance in, uh, in Ukraine, in Kiev, in National Ballet Academy. I studied there like for eight years, six, six days a week. I like how the public reacts when we perform, like when the dancers perform, because this energy from the, from the audience, you know, like we share the energy between each other. I think Americans are very emotional and like more open, like, you know, just to start to applause and wow and screaming, that, that's nice. <laughs> the sparkle in their eyes and knowing knowing ahead of time what they're gonna feel when they get out on that stage and they see that audience and they see the lights and they see all the dancers around them oh yes it's, it's gonna be an, a just a beautiful experience for them and I know ahead of time what that's gonna be like no matter what I get it's just a really good opportunity to dance with an amazing ballet company I was a little snowflake and actually the show is at the Turning, the Turning Stone Casino on my birthday. I was like turning seven, so like, I was like my first and I was like so little and I even remember it like, it was so cool just going to the rehearsal, everybody was there and it was like crazy because I like never danced with people like that before and it was just so happy. But. And people say like this is a once in a lifetime opportunity and like then I think about how Dance Center North's been with the Moscow Ballet for 25 years and we have this opportunity like for so long. I teach one of the higher level classes on Monday nights but a big part of what I do is teaching the Nutcracker rehearsals. That's what takes up actually most of my time here at the studio. I danced in the Nutcracker from the time I was eight years old. So I did every single role at one point or another. So my first year I was eight, I was a little snowflake. Um, and then auditioned every year after that, right up until I, was, I did the Arabian variation, um, Spanish variation. Once I graduated, then I came back and started helping Mrs. Mucci with teaching the kids. I think my favorite was the Arabian, but that's kind of everybody's favorite to do. It's sort of the coveted role. My favorite memory is more from when I was big, <laughs> because so I had all the years of you know learning and dancing the role, and then um, got to the point where I started teaching. Then there was one year where we had some extenuating circumstances come up where Mrs. Mucci actually got sick somewhere throughout the process. And so at the point where she stopped was the point where I kind of, since I was the next in line, stepped into her role. So that was kind of, it was an interesting experience for me because then I was suddenly doing things that she would normally do, seeing things from a perspective that you're not used to seeing them. It gave me an appreciation for what she's done for 25 years, 25 years. <laughs> you know? So it was just very cool to see things from that perspective. When you've been, you know, dancing all these years to actually see what it's like kind of stepping into that director feel in a certain way. I danced from um, the age of 10. Uh, the first year they came, I was 10 years old. And um, I danced uh, in it, I would say, until I graduated from high school. So um, probably for about seven years. I had a lot of favorite roles. Um, and I have a lot of memorable experiences from every single role, actually. Um, I, my very first one was a party child. Um, and that was very fun, you know, getting to you know, be in the dresses and enjoy all of that. My favorite role was definitely when I was the marzipan. Um, the little marzipan vari variation, um, and I, I wasn't scheduled to be a marzipan. Um, I was a little too tall for that, so I believe that year I was either a mouse or I was an angel. 
but I was double cast in it because somebody got sick that um, the day of the show. So they called me in here, right in this very room, and um, said, you know, okay, we're going to learn it, and here's the sheep, and this is how we have to do it. You know, Kathy had let me stay backstage um, pretty much throughout the whole entire show that year because of this me just being in this other role. Um, so I got to watch the whole thing from backstage. And I have photos of that and watching the glitter fall and watching her stand there and people coming on and yeah, it was a really neat memory. This is the all time memorable photo of me wearing that uh, beloved little sheep. Yeah. <laughs> I started at Dance Center North when I was three. And uh, stayed with them until I graduated at 18, and then um, I went away for school a couple times, but now I've come back and I work here, so. Mm -hmm. The soonest you could start performing is when you're like seven, maybe? And I performed pretty much until they kicked me out because I was too grown up. <laughs> I think I did about two years in each role, so I started out as a snowflake, did that for two years, and then you can, when I was doing it, you could be a snowflake in a little variation. So it was the baby marzipan and a little Arabian one year. And then two years as a party child. I think I did two years as a butterfly, which is, opens the second act. And then I was the big Spanish for two years, too, which is my favorite. They have the best costumes. It's like a, Describe the costume. Oh, it's like a long dress, you have a black bodice. And there's, I think we counted it, it was like nine layers of skirt. And uh, then you had this great clip that went in your hair with a long veil over the back. So when I was little and starting as a snowflake, I was like, I want those costumes someday. And then I did, I got to grow up and wear them. So this was the year I was a party child. And this is another really great costume. When you started out as a snowflake, you saw all the party children, then they were a little closer in age to you. So you were like, oh, that's doable. I'll, I'll do that someday. Yeah, I've been dancing at Dance Center North since I was in second grade. So about six years now. I've been dancing in the Great National Cracker for about four years. I was Snowflake, Snow Maiden, Russian Variation, and Party Child. Costume fitting was sometimes kind of itchy, but it was really pretty and the costumes are always very elegant, so it was very fun. The first time I was really small, but like the audience was just pitch black, so it was like no one was there, so it didn't really make me scared. I'm an instructor here at Dance Center North. I teach um, both ballet and modern dance. We were part of the first cast of the Nutcracker. I was um, both marzipan, Spanish, and ballet at that time, and again, it was just like the most exciting part of Christmas for me. My daughter, Eliana, um, is in her second year here, her first year with the Nutcracker. She'll be a snowflake this year. She's six years old and very excited about it. It does feel like a special thing for her to do something that her mom has taken part in. I remember um, every Christmas season, the Nutcracker was my favorite part of the season with the rehearsals and all the excitement around the performances. So I'm excited for her to uh, finally have a part in this and she's also with two of my nieces now who also dance here and this is their sec second Nutcracker. I grew up dancing at Dance Center North for many years now and I graduated from here in 2010 and I currently even live in New York City and I decided to come back home for it. Make a nice surprise. It's been a fantastic program. And I have many great memories working with Kathy. It's start from the very first year I even came in here. It was so welcoming and everyone's been so encouraging and throughout the whole years. They've helped push you and inspire you and it's just they give you so many opportunities. I've performed many years, I don't know, actually maybe 10 years in Moscow Ballet or also, yeah. My first year was in 2003 and I was a party child girl and a Harlequin doll and I was very excited the first year. It was on a Friday and I got to skip school and we made a big breakfast, but then a snowstorm hit. So the show was actually canceled. <laughs> and they rescheduled and we got to do it, but it was an interesting first year with that, but it was exciting to still put it on. I love the Chinese because during the Chinese you had the dragon going around. And I remember they used to go and like circle around us as we're trying to dance. And you're like memorized looking at it, you're like I gotta dance. But it was so neat, like the props and set. So that was like my first ever huge stage to be on at the landmark and it was like so amazing looking around seeing a whole audience of people and then just being backstage with Dan Center North's people but also Moscow and it was just like inspiring seeing you know what we put together um, with everyone else it was a fantastic feeling and I actually at Nutcracker is probably one of my favorite things 
it's it's a it's kind of bittersweet. Um, part of it is I'm thinking, oh my gosh, I'm 25 years older, <laughs> and they still look young. Um, so I I think it's just a blessing that that they um, you know are still a part of our life. Mm -hmm. They're still a part of Dance Center North. Their children are now coming to Dance Center North, and now they're participating in a Moscow Ballet Nutcracker. I just want to say a very big thank you for all of you who came today. Uh, this is very, very special for us. Uh, 25 years ago, I would have never, ever dreamed that we would be still a part of our partnership with the Moscow Ballet Nutcracker. Never in a million years would I have dreamed that. Um, it was and has been um, one of the greatest collaborations that we at Dance Center North have ever had. So we're very grateful to Dance or to uh, Moscow Ballet. We're grateful to Mary and Akiva, who are the producers. I think that uh, over the years, um, in watching all the young people who started out with Nutcracker, others who were here from the time we first started, uh, my niece, uh, there's so many who have gone on and had families and now their families are going to be a part of our performance. And just thank you for always being there with us. I brought you this oh, trophy for your nice. studio. <laughs> we just appreciate you so much. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, that is lovely.